Today I want to show you two useful JavaScript functions that you can use to convert text to either uppercase or lowercase. So as you can see, we have a variable here called text and we have a string value assigned to it. And this string value has a combination of upper and lowercase letters. And I want to change that to either all lowercase or all uppercase. So the way we do that is by first addressing the variable that has a reference to the value that we want to change. That's called text. So we say text, then we say dot to lower case, like so. And that's it. Now this is actually lowercase. Now to prove that, I'm going to do console.log and then we can log out the result over here. So I'm going to do command X or control X to X this out. And now I'm going to paste it in here with command V or control V. And I'm going to hit run. And we should now see a lowercase version of this right over here. And here it is. Great. Now, if you want to do this with uppercase, you probably already guessed it. You just change lower to upper. Okay. And then you hit run. And there it is. Cool. Let's clear this out. Now, what's really important to understand is that we have not performed a mutation on this text variable. Okay, so mutation just means modify, change, update, right? We have not done that. This text variable and its value is still the same as it was before, even though we performed this to uppercase and before the to lowercase function on it. So what we basically did when we did this part is that we created a temporary copy of this and then we modified that, but we have not modified the original text. You cannot do that. You cannot mutate um, variables with the two lowercase or the two uppercase functions. But what you can do instead, I'm just going to remove this, is that you can create new variables. So now I'm going to say let lowercase text, right? Then I'm going to say equals text dot to lowercase, double parentheses, and that's it, right? So now I'm going to do the exact same for the uppercase. I'm just going to change this to uppercase and this to uppercase. And now I'm going to log out all these results because now we actually have three variables with three different versions of this text, right? So I'm going to say console.log like so. I'm going to copy it two times like so. I'm going to add text inside like so. And now let's run this. And now we should see the original text, the lowercase version and the uppercase version. And it works. Great. That's it for today. I'll talk to you guys later.